First, I want to give a shout out to my boy Game of the Plug, the number one account seller in the NBA 2K community. He has over 5,000 vouchers. If y'all want to get an account from him, make sure y'all use code DNL. Tell him I sent you. He'll give you a discount and a percentage off. Links will be in the description down below. What's good, YouTube? This is your boy. DNL, come back to another video, man. Y'all know what it is. Y'all know what it is. If you have not, make sure you hit that like button on the video. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. We got our official NBA 2K22 video dropping. You feel me? Next gen. We got next gen and current gen. Right now, we're going to be starting off on the next gen. I got a nice ass build for y'all boys. I know me. I'm going to get y'all right. Build videos, jump shot videos, six videos, all that, bro. So make sure I hit that smash that like button. First off, my birthday was a couple weeks ago. It is free to support the channel. So make sure I smash that like button, like I said. But yeah, as you can see, y'all know me. I do my research. I think we got a really, really, really good build this year. I got a two-way three-point playmaker. I'm going to be showing y'all exactly how to make this build. We get potential 11 finishing badges, 26 shooting badges, 32 playmaking badges, and 17 defensive badges, you feel me? And we get contact dunks. We get a high-ass three-pointer, and we get all the dribble six in the game, my nigga. And we get Hall of Fame and gold defensive badges. So, yeah. Let's jump straight into this video, like I said. All right, y'all. So what y'all want to do is y'all want to go with a six foot three height. Y'all want to go with 170 on the pounds, bro, and six foot eight wingspan. It does not matter what body shape y'all want. I know a lot of y'all, y'all want solid, defined, built, a slight compact. It don't matter, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? Body shape does not matter, but y'all got to make sure I copy my build exactly how it is because the next gen builder this year is extremely extremely complicated and y'all have to make sure you copy the exact way i cannot stress this enough to you because one little mistake could determine whether you get a badge on hall of fame whether you get a badge on gold whether you can't get contact dunks, whether you can't get certain dribble animations so i'm gonna need y'all to pay attention closely to my exact build i do got a two-way three-point playmaker i could do literally everything in the game as far as the dribble sigs, the the contact dunks, and the shooting, bro. You know what I'm saying? So it is an extremely versatile build. Now, what y'all want to do is y'all want to go straight to the physicals down here, down below. You're going to start off with a 94 speed and a 93 acceleration. What people don't know is you get plus four on gym rap. Um, gym rap, my bad. Either you complete all your training in the, in the facility, uh, the Gatorade facility, or you can complete my career. If you complete my career, you get automatically plus four to all physicals. So that means you're going to have a 98 speed and a 97 acceleration as a 6'3 guard and 6'8 wingspan, you feel me? So we're going to max out your, your stamina and we're going to go down and you're going to put your vertical to 69, okay? Your vertical is going to be 69. Do not touch nothing else in the physicals, bro. Max out your perimeter defense. Then we're going to go down to the steel and I'm and I'm explaining to you right now what the steel is. You're going to put down your steel to 86, okay? Do not put it no higher than 86. Is it 86? Is it 86 or 89? My bad. I think it's 89. My fault. Because you get 17 defensive badges. Go to 89 because you will have... Look. You still get gold pickpocket, gold pick dodger, gold inter uh, 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 interceptor, and you still get, you know, clamp silver. You still get some really, really good badges, bro. You still get some really, really good badges. So make sure y'all keep it at 89 and 81 so you can get those gold defensive badges. You feel me? Now, we're going to go straight to the shooting. We're going to go with an 89 three-pointer right now and a 75 midi. Just keep it right there for temporarily because we're going to go straight to playmaking. Max out your ball handling and max out speed with the ball. 92 speed with the ball and 90 ball control. You unlock every single dribble move in the game. You're six foot three, and you're going to be extremely fast. Like I said, 98 speed. Then you're going to have uh, 92 speed with the ball, you're gonna be extremely fast, and you're still gonna have a high enough ball control to the point where you have every dribble move in the game. So, even though we have seasons this year with NBA 2K, as far as seasons, a lot of y'all don't know they're dropping patch patches like on the regular as far as uploading new dribble moves the entire year. If you copy this build, you're gonna be able to get every single dribble move throughout the entire year. You're not gonna have to worry about making a new build because you can't get these dribble moves or this build is gonna get every dribble move for the entire year, bro. Now your pass accuracy, we're gonna go to, we're gonna go into detail with that in a little bit. But right now, go to your drive and dunk and put it up to an 80. 80 drive and dunk so you can secure that silver posterizer. Because you're not gonna this build is not really a paint mashing build. You're gonna be able to dunk, yes. But this is not a build that's like, oh yeah, bro, I'm gonna go dunk on somebody every play. Like, no. This play right here, th this build right here is simply 
a extremely versatile build. Like you're gonna be able to play defense, you're gonna be able to shoot the ball, and you're gonna be able to dribble and do whatever the hell you want with the ball. You feel me? And you're gonna be fast as hell. And you're gonna be really good on defense, bro. So posterize, you're still gonna be able to get them contact dunks, you're still gonna be able to get them dunk animations, the good the best dunk animations in the game. 80 driving dunk, like I said. If you want, if you want to, by all means necessary, if you want to tweak the build and just go out all out with a 92 driving dunk, and you just want elite contact dunks and elite uh, and, and gold posterizer, by all means necessary, my boy, go ahead. Just know that you're gonna mess up the build. You know what I'm saying? But I'm not stopping you. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, we're gonna go with an 80 driving dunk right here. Like I said, silver posterizer. Um, because as you can see, everything you move, it tweaks all the, it tweaks everything. Like they made the builder extremely, extremely like balanced this year. Last year it was broken. They tweaked a lot of stuff, but make sure y'all pay attention to what you're upgrading. Because as you can see, like, even if you move down the slightest bit, all these badges drop. You know what I'm saying? I went from an 89 three pointer down and all these badges just, just dropped like the silver. So make sure you max out your three pointer to an 89 because you're going to be able to have all these shooting badges still on Hall of Fame and gold. Don't worry about having all Hall of Fame. It is pretty easy to shoot this year. Okay? It's pretty easy to shoot this year. So make sure you still get them gold badges. You gonna have Hall of Fame, but it is easy to shoot this year. You don't need like no Hall of Fame everything, okay? At least for right now. So go to your pass accuracy. This is what you need to this is what you need to upgrade it to. If y'all see bullet passer, we need bullet passer on gold. Bullet passer on gold and needle threader so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go 87 pass accuracy so it's gonna secure that 32 potential playmaking badges okay so right now we got 11 25 32 17 and the rest you can easily put it up to your midi you know what i'm saying so we could have 11 27 32 17 so you're gonna still get your contact dunks you're gonna have an 80 midi 89 three-pointer you're gonna have all the dribble animation you're gonna be fast as hell the ball you're still gonna be having really really good defense okay y'all so make sure y'all copy this exact build just like i have it six foot three 170 pounds six foot eight wingspan shooting guard we got 11 potential finishing badges as you can see the badges that we can get civil posterizer gold unstrippable meaning like when you go into the basket people can't really strip you i think that's gonna be a thing this year with like a guards they're not gonna get a lot of blocks they're just gonna strip you this year you got teardropper bronze, silver uh, slittery finisher, silver lob city, silver limitless takeoff. Limitless takeoff is an underrated badge. This year I can tell you that because we've been doing a lot of research as far as the play now. We've been using Giannis. Giannis is the best dunker in the game. Probably him and Zion. And they have limitless takeoff like on Hall of Fame. They be dunking from there in the, uh, the free throw line, bro. Like So this is a low key and important badge this year because you need to be able to dunk far. Silver limitless takeoff. Put back boss. I'm a six foot three guard. I'm not gonna really need this. I'm I'm not gonna use that. I get on Hall of Fame. We're gonna go down to my shooting badges. Gold blinders, gold cash shoot. Pretty much everything you see here is gold to Hall of Fame. Difficult shots is gonna be silver because our midi's kind of low and we're not gonna really be fading anyway. So we got pretty much all the Hall of Fame shooting badges we need and the gold shooting badges that we need for this build right here. Now this is where it's important. As you can see, the playmaking badges. Like I said, you're gonna be fast as hell with the ball. You're going to have every six in the game, all the dribble moves in the game, and you got pretty much all the playmaking badges you need. Like I said, you got Hall of Fame, quick first step. You got gold handle for days. You got Hall of Fame, space creator, gold ankle breaker, Hall of Fame, tight handles. You got needle threaded on gold, bullet pass on gold, downhill on gold, on Hall of Fame. Um, You got unpluckable, what, gold. Pretty much all you need for your scoring badges, like your scoring playmaking badges. It's pretty much there. The only thing that's not there is probably like the diamond and floor general. But that goes with the pass accuracy. The more pass accuracy you have, the higher it is. The better the passing badges are going to be. But as far as your scoring badges, like your dribbling badges, it's all pr pretty much perfect, bro. You know what I'm saying? We, we good. You know what I'm saying? We straight. Defensive badges, here's really, here's the key. Silver clamps. Yeah, y'all probably going to be like, oh, yeah, bro. You need gold clamps, Hall of Fame. You really don't, I don't in my opinion, because... Like I said, I don't think a lot of people are really worried about defensive badges this year. But gold pick dodger and gold pick pocket, a lot of people are going to be using pick and pops. Everybody can shoot in the game this year, so expect a lot of pick and pops. So pick dodger, I feel like it's going to be a key. Interceptor gold, you're still going to have a 6 foot 8 wingspan, so you can still be in lanes. Silver ankle braces, ball stripper. Like I said, a lot of centers are going to be paint mashing this year. And um, you can strip them. Guards, if they go to the basket, you can strip them. So I think that's going to be a good badge this year also. 
we're gonna go down to our physicals and physicals are self-explanatory like i said you're gonna be having a 98 speed with a with plus four gym rat you're gonna have a 97 acceleration with plus four gym rat so let's jump straight into the uh the badges uh, uh the, not the badges but the takeover system now the takeover system is a, is extremely similar to uh nba next uh nba 2k next gen from 21 so you're gonna have two takeovers okay now you're not gonna have no slashing takeovers, okay? We didn't put enough play. We did not put enough finishing into our, our attribute system for us to get any slashing takeovers. So if you really want to redo your badges or redo your attributes, and you really, really fiending for that slashing posterizer takeover and all that, by all means necessary, my boy, you can go ahead. But right now we got shot creating badge. Uh, we got limitless ranges badge. We got our uh, sharpshooter badge. We got playmaking badges, and we got lock take. Y'all know me. I'm going with extreme clamps as my first one. Stones, walls, ball handlers into. Uh, it says stone walls, ball handlers into more four stops pickups and fumbles when bodying them. Basically, you bump them. They're gonna pick up the ball. They gonna lose their dribble. It's gonna be easy to guard the ISO players. It's gonna be easy to guard the pick and roll. It's gonna be easy to guard the pick and pops. As soon as you get your takeover, you're gonna be locking people up. That's exactly what that is. And if you play twos, I made this build for twos, pretty much. It's going to be good for threes. I really made this build for twos because, like I said, you need to be able to get stops. You're not going to play twos and not get stops, bro, because it's make it, take it. You have to get a stop. Threes, you can play make it, trade it. Threes is worth more than twos, so people like getting 300 builds, like builds at 300 on the threes court, so they can just keep shooting threes. Twos, you need stops, so I go Hall of Fame. Uh, I go Extreme Clamp still. Now, for your secondary badge, go at Limitless Range, bro. Because this is pretty much like a three-point facilitator on NBA 2K20. A two-way three-point facilitator, in my opinion. So, yes, we're going to create the build. And as you can see, the name of the build is going to come out to a two-way three-point playmaker. And I think this build is going to be extremely, extremely good. Like I said, you could test build. You know what I'm saying? And like I said, these badges and these attributes are going to be really good. Like I said... You're going to get your posterizer badge. You're going to get your contact dunk animations. You got an 89 three-pointer. You get all the dribbling, uh, dribble sigs in the game, all the dribble moves. And you're going to be fast as hell without the ball and with the ball. So if y'all like the video, make sure y'all smash that. If y'all enjoyed the video, make sure y'all smash that like button. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, look at the badge points. Look at the badge points. Say if we put silver limitless takeoff and say we put, and say we put, uh, Lob City Silver, and say we put Posterizer Silver, and then we go Unstrippable. Actually, no, we go Lob City Bronze. Then we go Unstrippable. My fault. So we can go Slittery Finisher. What, what is that? Where is it at? I go Slittery Finisher Silver, and we go Unstrippable Bronze. So we got Limitless Takeoff. We got Lob City Finisher. We got Unstrippable. Then we got Posterizer. And then we got uh, Slittery Finisher. You feel me? Now with the shooting. Now, here's what you can do with the shooting. There's so much shit you can do with the shooting, bro. I'm just going through the badges that you could possibly get. I don't know exactly my final lineup for badges, but they got badge layouts this year where you can have badges specifically for the twos, specifically for the ones, for the threes. So, like, you could change your badges all around, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? Don't stress. Don't worry about the badges right now. But just look at all the options. I just want you to look at all the options for the shooting badges. You got every shooting badge in the game. Some Hall of Fame, some gold, but pretty much every single shooting badge in the game, you have gold, at least. You know what I'm saying? So if you need Dead Eye Gold, you can get Dead Eye Gold. Green Machine Gold, get Green Machine. You know what I'm saying? Blinders Gold, get Blinders Gold. Then you obviously got the badges like Catch Shoot. Maybe if you want to go Catch Shoot, you want to get cl uh, Clutch Shooter. You can get Clutch Shooter, Hot Zone 100 Gold. Like, you got a lot of really, really good. Even if you want to spot up. You can get Hall of Fame Corner Special. There's a lot of shooting badges you can get this year, bro. Like, don't really stress too much about the badges. I'm just going around with it. I don't know what I'm going with for my final badge setup. But like I said, even with the playmaking badges, you got pretty much everything in the game. Everything in the game. Say if you go Gold Ankle Breaker, you know what I'm saying? You got, you got, where's my Hall of Fame Quick First Step? Hall of Fame Quick First Step. Then you got Gold Bailout. You know I like using Bailout. Then you got Handle for Days Gold. You still got you, you got some really 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 good badges this year, bro. Needle thread of gold, and then you need where, where is it at? Where's that passing one? Um, that you need. You need this one right here. Where is it at? It's a pat. It's bullet passer. Sorry. All right, there we go. You know what I'm saying? You gotta go with that bullet passer, and then whatever you want to do with the with, with the rest. Whatever you want to do with the rest. Unpluckable uh gold, and say if you want to put like, 
I don't know. Ty, uh, space crate on bronze. I don't know, bro. So now with the defensive badges here, I would say go interceptor gold, interceptor gold, and pick dodger gold. Clamp silver. That's mandatory. I say, pickpocket gold, and I say probably ball stripper on silver. Like, it, but you got a whole lot of options to choose from. Like I said, bro, you got a whole lot of options to choose from. <clears throat> So like I said, yeah, six foot three, one seventy, with the six eight wingspan. You can start off with an eighty driving dunk. You can start off with your eighty nine three pointer. This is all what you can start off with. So even if you want to start off the game and you need to buy VC, you can start off like your build is gonna be usable. Like you know what I'm saying? You can upgrade your speed, your acceleration. Your guy is gonna be ready for the park off rip, pretty much. You know what I'm saying? So make sure y'all smash that like button on the video. Make sure y'all subscribe to the channel. With nothing else to talk about, your boy Dino is out. See, I'm a rock star, baby, I'm a rock star Shit, I wanna travel around the world with my rock star, bitch Take a bit, cause I'm flashing that way I can say the clip I'm the future, it was now, you